Hello folks, welcome back to another EDU Band Lab lesson. Today we are creating a short music bed with three loops. First we head over to an old assignment. Remember, after you click Start Assignment, to select the Teacher's Assignment as your next step. Once the assignment has loaded, select Browse Loops from the menu box. Next, let's take a moment and audition some packs to find ones we like the sounds in. Okay, this first one sounds like a winner, so double click the pack to access it. Using the search filter, we will choose the drum category to start our loop selection process. Remember to press the little play button to audition each loop. Double click on the loop name to add it to our track list. Next in the search filter, pick out bass to choose our next loop. Once again, double click on the loop name to add it to our track list. Back in the search filter, let's pick the synth category to find our last loop to use. One last time, double click on the loop name to add it to our track list. Now we are going to loop the loops out to make our music bed longer. First click on the loops button to hide the menu. Next, click on the zoom out button to show the timeline of the song out to bar 17. This is the bar we're going to end our song at, so we're going to stretch our song that distance. Now click on the upper right corner of a loop. You will see a double arrow appear. Now hold your left button down and drag the loop out to the right. This will cause our loop to repeat until we stop dragging at bar 17 in our timeline. Let go, and you've just looped your first loop. Next, we will repeat the same process for the other loops. Upper right corner, double arrow, click, hold, and drag to 17. Now that everything is looped out, let's take a listen to what we have. Sounds pretty good, but I want to change the volume levels on the tracks. You can find the volume for each track right underneath the track name on the far left of the track list. Adjust the volume by clicking and dragging to the right or the left. Next we're going to adjust the beat a little bit. Remember to use your ears to find what sounds best to you. Okay, I think we got it. We just built a music bed out of three loops, a bass, a drum, and a synth. So the next thing for us to do is to click Save and Submit, and then we can exit out of our assignment. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see you next time.